But it's a penalty of the job that yes. you can't behave as you used to. Well, I think that's probably just as well if you knew how I used to behave. <laughs> <laughs> but did you know what you were taking on in, in that kind of sense? Not being able to just walk down the street? No, I didn't. Did you find it difficult to adapt? I did, yes. Purely because there was so much attention on me when I first arrived on the scene and I wanted to get my act together, so to speak. And I had so many people watching me and I just, the pressure was enormous. But as years go on, it gets better. But it's still, you're still learning all the time. Do you feel, the two of you, that you are in touch with young people, plain young people of your age? I think you are, darling, aren't you? Yes. I mean, she's younger than me, <laughs> which is a great thing. By quite a long way, it was very bad luck on her. Because um, I'm sure it must be absolute hell living with an ancient old thing like me. But, um, uh, no, I, I mean, one of the things is that uh, I, tr I trust to keep me reasonably young in, in, in some aspects. But I just, I've, I've had great fun in the last few years um, since the status quo, that group offered the proceeds of, of a, their 21st birthday concert to the Prince's Trust. And um, as a result of that, I, I've since then met an awful lot of um, groups, and, and then together we've met a lot. And, and it has been the greatest fun meeting a lot of, a lot of them and, and hearing their music, which I must admit I hadn't heard much before. <laughs> um, mainly because, I don't know, there's the time factor and things, and I do like classical music. But I also like some, uh, some pop music, not all of it by any means. Do your tastes coincide? On what? Pop, pop music? music? Well, yes, sometimes, yes. <laughs> not always. I mean, <laughs> some, some I, I, I don't, and you don't necessarily well, mind. Well, I've got a reputation for liking all the people we go to concerts with, but we go and we hopefully it's going to raise money for my husband's charities. But um, we're great. Both of us love classical music and the opera and the ballet and go whenever we can to see it. And you're pretty self-reliant when you want to listen to music because you have your own stereo headphones that you take with you. Yes, I have. I'm a great believer in having music wherever I go, whether it's um, a headset or a radio or a record player. And it's just a big treat to go out for a walk with music still coming out with me. And I, I tend to listen to an enormous amount of classical music, whether it's Greek, Rachmaninoff or Schumann. And all my family, my side of the family, are very music orientated, and that's where I've picked it up from. I love it. And you still play the piano? Yes, I play that. It's nothing to get excited about by any means, but I really enjoy it. It's very therapeutic. It's lovely. Now, you both like skiing, and yet every year it has become a regular. <laughs> you don't appear to hit it off exactly eye to eye on the slopes. What don't is the we? secret of this? Don't we? You two read papers. But <laughs> if I can help it. Um, <laughs> I suspect most husbands and wives find that uh, they often have arguments. But we don't. No, no, no. But occasionally we do, because, I mean, no, I, I'm, you know, I, <laughs> I, I, I go on longer sometimes. Yes, but I'm faster. <laughs> There we are. But uh, no, I mean, the, the other, last year, there was, it was really, I think, probably because there was a total misunderstanding. And somebody had, um, had tried to arrange something differently, differently to what had, we'd been told. And, and that's how the confusion arose there. Well, there was no confusion on the day of the wedding. And in many, many people's minds around the world, that is the image of the partnership. At what stage? going to the cathedral, actually during the service. At what stage did you get the idea that it was becoming an enormous success so that you could enjoy it? Enjoy something like that? Oh, God. Mm. It was terrifying. Such a long walk up that aisle for a start. No, I'm only teasing. Um, am I? <laughs> 